Welcome Libra. This is your singles le uh, reading for July. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Uh, we do nothing but love readings here. Uh, if you So feel free to subscribe. I can't even talk. Sorry, guys. Um, <laughs> we are going to get right into your situation, see what's coming through for you. We're going to clarify. And at the end of the reading, I am going to pull the um, messages of love to see what this person has to say. So first, we'll start off with the AF tarot deck to see what energies are coming out for you. We have metamorphosis, which is all about profound change and self-awareness, but it's in reverse. We have the Four of Rings coming through in reverse. Whoa. Seven of Wands coming in in reverse. Persistence and Conviction. And Five of Wands. Someone is not self-aware. I mean, they are. Oh, I can see what you're doing. Okay. Yeah. This person needs an awakening that's all i gotta say they need an awakening this is an energy that is very stubborn tunnel vision doesn't really listen to anyone you can see you can feel it this could be a past person you're dealing with yeah it never takes accountability for their actions thinking they're always right we have a challenge of the queen of wands okay so we have a lot of jealousy and possessiveness here seven of pentacles Somebody is spying on you. Yeah, they want to either see if you're happy or they could be acting happy. <clears throat> Star. No, you're dealing with the devil. I knew it. I knew it. Right when I saw this, I was like, that person is playing like themselves, basically. They're not playing you because you see very clearly. So somebody from the past or someone here that you have a close connection with or had a close connection with, um, I feel that they're in that frustration stage. This is a person who really doesn't, it's like kind of like a one-sided situation. And hey, I feel like you're moving to calmer waters as you're more standing strong and holding yourself very good here, okay, with the strength card. It's having courage, it's being brave, it's facing challenges head on and knowing you're going to overcome it. The Four of Pentacles is here because you're protecting yourself. This is more of you standing strong, grounding, okay? Could have blocked this person or just really just not putting any effort in. Two of Swords is more of a hard decision. So there is a decision, but still mate right now, okay? I feel like you may be blocking this person or just needing to rest from this energy, rest your mind, rest your heart, everything, um, because there could be some some issues here with this Three of Cups. And the Three of Cups doesn't always mean there's a third party, but it does could mean drinking, um, someone kind of covering up their emotions here <clears throat> with substance, parting too much, or whatever that may be, okay? Uh, somebody you could be looking at as um, not to be taken seriously anymore. The devil is here in the outcome. And then we have the queen of swords, the three of wands, and the page of cups, and the moon. Yeah. I don't think this person knows that you're moving away from them. Like you're moving away. Like you're detaching. Because they're not even self-aware of them of, of the situation, I feel. I feel like they think they're maybe in control of it. And they're going to have some big awakening. Not big awakening, but a big surprise um, in the end. We do have the sun. So you do, this person's actions towards you is to, I don't know, show you what they missed. But I don't, I don't know why they're acting like the sun. They're not the sun. I feel like this isn't a big act. The star is what you don't see coming. So a lot of healing, a lot of prayers, a lot of blessings. And that's why the devil is here in the outcome, trying to block your blessings. Okay. What is this justice card for Libra's person? That's too many cards. Sorry. Ah, but we did have the tower. So let's see. I feel like this person is just resisting change. Maybe this is an energy that always has to be right, okay? But I feel karma is here. Let's get one more. 
someone's holding on to this connection really, really tightly. This person could be codependent, but they are manifesting you. Trying to plan something here. Yeah, they have the Nine of Swords, anxiety, depression, sleepless nights. Person can't sleep. They're very restless. You could be feeling this way too. That that's their that could be their energy that you could be feeling if you're still feel tied, energetically tied to this person. Um, six of cups. Yeah, this is the devil that you're dealing with. Aries Leo Sagittarius, for some of you guys, could have separated from them. You're, it feels like you're getting away from a very toxic relationship. Um, recovering or leaving a, you know, a very toxic situation. Detaching and freeing yourself from this person. I feel like there was a lot of like um, lust, okay? But also a lot of games. This person is secretly obsessed with you. But I feel like they showed you that they didn't want anything to do with you. But in reality... I feel like you're seeing that this person may be attached to you a little too much. Um, that's what I feel behind the scenes. As you pull away or start healing, you could just tell that this devil is really trying to block it here. Trying to play games with you. All right. Yeah. The challenge is that they come in charming in a way, wanting your attention. And they, yeah, and then they end up hurting you in a way. There is a big choice I feel when it comes to this connection. I feel there is a need for more self love, or that's what you're doing. This could be a breakup or a disconnect here, or feeling a lot of con uh, conflict or indecisiveness when it comes to this connection. But I do feel like there is a choice when it comes to this person. They can be the Knight of Cups, but the Knight of Cups is the Knight of Cups is a knight. They're, they're a traveler. They come in with emotions or act, right? They're good actors. But really, it's more to kind of see if they have you still around. Because they could be mo um, very moody also and uh, very unrealistic. This person could, you know, not take accountability of avoid things, um, so this Knight of Cups is more of an energy of, of, of someone trying to charm their way back in. They want some type of recognition. But you're dealing with the devil. Yeah, you're dealing with another knight. They're coming in very impatient though. Yeah, they see, they feel like you went, you're withdrawing and they're spying on you. They're making it seem like they left, but they didn't. I don't know what energy you're dealing with. This devil is so bad. It's annoying, actually. Okay, it's all a game. <laughs> yeah. They're spying. They're wanting more information. What's the sun? I wouldn't even look at this person's stories if you guys watch their stories or if you follow them because they're just fake playing. They're fake being happy, all to trigger you. The self-imposed in prison of thoughts. This person is literally in, consumed by you. Swords are all about your mind, okay? So they're trapped and they're, 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 they're in that victim mentality here and they're feeling powerless at this time to where they want you to know that they're happy. I don't know who that's for, but that's for some of you and they want you, they want your power and they're going to try other ways to get it because you're emotionally detaching from this person. Yeah, you're ending it. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful, Libra. I can't. You are so protected. You have the death, the hair, the will of fortune. You have 10 of pentacles. You have so much abundance coming in. Holy moly, that's what they're protecting. Look. Your wish fulfillments are coming in, and that is your Ten of Pentacles. This devil is trying to block it. The universe is trying to push you back on path to get closer to your spirituality. You're already a spiritual teacher, they're saying, okay? You already have all the answers you speak. You can help people. This person is not to be helped. This is a game player. This person would never be the hierophant, especially with the devil around, okay? The death is here because there's an ending. 
there's a, there's a big change, a type of transformation. So you are feeling that transition. It can feel very, very uncomfortable. It can make you overthink things. It can make you feel like, you know, go through a lot of emotions. But it's very, but the universe is trying to help you. It's protecting you. The universe is in control of the situation. And then the star is telling you, hey, all your wishes are coming true. You have so many wishes coming in that the devil knows it. And that's why they're coming out in the outcome. Yeah. Devil. Oh, yeah, a message. Here they go again. Arguments, conflict. Wanting peace now. But they're coming from the devil energy. And what's the devil energy? They're liars. Manipulators. They're toxic. They're obsessed. They're abusive. It's all about lust, control. Okay? And that's what's coming in. What you don't see coming is all this. All your wishes coming true. You being blocked because, from this connection because spirit is trying to push you on your path. Because you have so much abundance on that path. And this person is trying to distract you and give you a message. Very clear here. That's why it's so hard to be strong for some of you guys. Because the temptation right there. Alright. I'm saying some, not all. But you're coming up very intelligent. You're coming up very, very intelligent. Very like cold. I just feel like you're just wanting to move forward and just leave this person behind. Somebody feels your energy. They feel you removing yourself. They feel you detaching. They feel you not giving a crap if they call you or not. They feel that. There was someone interfering in our relationship. It could be friends, family. This person misses you. And finances are a problem. This person can have financial problems too. And they dive in and out of relationships. Okay. Very strong. Friendship. Nurture the bonds of friendship within your relationship and your love life will dra dramatically improve. It's important right now to take a step back and spend some time alone instead of placing your focus on another. Now is the time to give to yourself. Yes. There's something that's developing within a friendship here. Okay. Let's see if there's any new love <clears throat> coming in for you guys. Oh, we do. You already met the romantic partner that you seek. For a lot of you guys, could be starting to talk to someone. Sorry, too many cards. So let's see. Calling in your soulmate. It's asking you to stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Your pra prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together, calling in your soulmate, honeymoon, and this could be the one. Now, I am feeling a little bit of a love bomb situation. So if you are starting something new, I feel like that's for some of you, okay? So I would just be aware of the love bombing. But I'm going to go ahead and leave it here. I do see that there's asking you to stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Uh, I do feel with this energy, maybe the love bomber for some of you guys. Or this is that's the situation. Um, again, it's for some, not all. You would know. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and leave it here for you, Libra. I really hope you enjoyed this reading. And if you did, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys very soon. God bless.